Hey guys, this is Team Man 2817 here. And I'm gonna be doing a Roxio how to video. How to set up the Roxio. I'm not gonna have all the stuff with me now. You'll you'll get it if I just tell you. Well, first, this is where these ones these ones appear. The red, green, and blue cords go in these slots here. And that comes with the Roxio. But there's a little catch with it when you buy the Roxio. That's why it's seventy dollars. It you need an extra cord if you're if you're a PlayStation user user, you need an extra it just makes you go crazy. <laughs> like me right now, I'm just freaking out because I was like, I mean, I was waiting for this thing, like, all, all day. I mean, okay, well, back to the review, sorry. I was almost going to go on a rant there. Anyway, here are the other cables that you are supposed to plug into the TV. And these are the audio cables here, red, red and white. You plug those into here, well, either one of them, and you, what you pretty much do is from there, if you plug it into your TV also, so it gets the, so it receives that, and then you plug the extra P PS3 cords that, or Xbox cords that you have to use into these slots, and it makes you just want to go crazy, but, um, whatever. No, 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 no. And then here's the USB. That will come with the set also. That is for the computer to... Well, sorry guys. That is for you to... Um, how should I put this? Um, to bring it onto your computer. And if you guys are wondering, it's not a certain kind of USB cable you use. It's just one of those regular ones. And here's what the Roxio looks like when it's all plugged up in there. PlayStation cords go in there, or Xbox. And, um, here's the disc, the installation disc. Yeah, you see that? Whatever. Insulation. And, well, yeah, that's mostly it, guys. I'm sorry I didn't get to do the whole thing today, but I hope you guys get a little visual on it's supposed to be. Alright, peace out. Alright.